What's going on guys? Berg's back here for another one today. Creek. Long cut straight. Let's get a look at the presentation. You've got a darker red color than the, the uh, cherry red over here on the cherry product, as you can see, more in line with what you'd expect from a straight dip. Creek, long cut moist snuff straight. It is not uh, overly fancy, but it is, it is pretty nice, actually. Net weight, 1.2 ounces, sale only allowed in the United States, 100% domestically grown tobacco. Swisher International, Wheeling, West Virginia, tax class M. 75 cents off and on the back 100% American made discovercreek.com and the new code system um, fairly nice can on the can redesign I have to say the only thing is they use basically the same font for their creek and kayak or very similar um, you know I, I feel like they could have put a little picture on there or, or something uh, you know, if you look at old logos, uh, I think Kayak and Silver Creek both had a, you know, some kind of image on the back that was made it a little more interesting, but some of these cans have been a little harder than you would expect to crack. It's like there's glue overloaded in here or something. Um, I don't know. Let's see if it comes off. I went around twice actually just to see because last time, yeah, it did did get it there. Okay. Um, cut on it is this mid and long cut mixture. Um, now, you know, I don't really care for straight as a flavor as a whole, but I can tell that I especially probably won't like this one. Very, uh, classic straight, like non-sweetened, or, or not, not not sweetened, but very uh, less sweetened than, say, Copenhagen. Very, I don't know, kind of strong smelling at the same time. So, usually uh, a lot of these budget straights really, really aren't to my liking, but we'll see. Again, pinches pretty well. I'll go back for a little extra. Mm. Decent amount of straight flavor right off the bat. So again, this is Silver Creek rebranded by Swisher at, into the new Creek brand. Uh, Long Cut Straight is a flavor that they had before. They have had all of these before, except Long Cut Mint and Fine Cut Natural, uh, both of which were, and to my knowledge, still are available over on the, in the kayak line. Um, so, you know, I, I've never, straight's always been the flavor that I found less appealing. I don't know why it just it just the way it went you know um i've tried basically all of them uh, at least once for the video and some of them more often than others um just for your own information some of the ones that i enjoy more would be stuff like copenhagen straight um grizzly dark select i actually have gone through a few cans of um as i switch it up every now and then and uh when i was buying all those seasonal cans i i bought the dark select i think every time so but it doesn't mean that you know the others are undippable it's just it it would not be something i would buy outside of a video um this one though it, it's definitely leaning bitter it I, t I have a slight taste of something unusual in the background that is probably the Swisher standard tobacco that's used in their dip. 
Um, but at the same time, it's not creating some kind of like sketchy flavor, like, you know, sometimes you taste in, in these third tier naturals and stuff, but I'm really not getting anything like that. It's just kind of a bland, like not all that sweet, leaning bitter, almost uh, a straight dip. So to me, I don't really, don't really care for that flavor, but it's not to say that the flavor is undippable or anything. Um, you know, that all that in mind, it actually, you know, might be better than some of these other creeks that I've just done. So, um, I really don't have a ton more to say about it, actually. I mean, it is, you know, it is priced down there with stuff like Longhorn, a little bit higher than Kayak, it seems, um, maybe about $2.00 something like that. It is, it has not made its way around my area too much yet. I picked all of these up when I was going across the country a little while ago. Um, so that said, I mean, it's, it's an all right, it's an all right straight. It, it's not, not great by any means, but it's not terrible either. I would probably give it about a five out of 10. Um, you could go either way with the stuff really. So, shout outs, suit and tie, dip and chew guy, wayside lee, 83, no bluff buff, snuff strings, snooze freak, and wild bushman, check all of them out. Uh, that is about it for the creek straight, I have two more to go, uh, so if you enjoyed the video, leave it a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next time, take care.